Hi, welcome to this week's Desmond's Donders. In a change of schedule, I'm going to have a quick chat about the changes to YouTube. OK, so they've changed the rules. It's now going to take 1,000 subscriptions, 4,000 hours in a 12-month period of views to be able to monetize. They've raised the barrier. Great, so what? It doesn't really make any difference to this channel. At the time of recording, we've been hovering around 275, 280 view, uh, subscriptions, which is great. For a little hobby channel, I put up the videos and make the videos to record our journeys and have a little bit of a, a say about various things, just to tell people what we're up to, what we're doing. I do it as a hobby. It's got nothing to do with money for me. Yes, I've had the adverts up. That was more of a bit of research. A little bit of research. Um, I monetized when I first come and then they ch came on and they, they changed the rules then. And in that time, my figures raised about £10. They said a little while ago when they changed rules on monetization for the big channels, blah, 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 things are, are, are worse than they were. So I put the adverts, the monetization, back on to see what it was. And yes, I believe them. Um, the revenue over roughly the same period of time I had the adverts up was about a third uh, of what it was previously with a lot more viewers. So yeah, the big channels were right. Not a problem. My adverts are now off uh, because the number of viewers, etc. They would have been off anyway in, in 30 days time, a month's time. So uh, I've taken them off. There's, there's no point in them being there. Um, in all the time I've been on uh, a total of £13 and you, you have to raise 16, 60, 60 before you get a payment. So. It's, uh, it's not for me anyway, and it's not why I do them. What is more disturbing is that some of the tools that video creators use are being removed at the same time. Now they say they're not going to do this, um, or they're trying not to do this, blah blah blah, um, but I can, I can see it happening. So those tools I find useful, um, if they're not there, I'll still produce the videos. Um, things like the little information that appear up in the, the, the corner, uh, the branding, the uh, the end cards which I don't use, but uh, some of the other tools that you don't really see um, are going to go missing. So they've already taken one I started using, which was the featured videos, which was the, the black thing that popped up uh, in the bottom corner for those of you that uh, watch towards the end of the videos. Uh, so there you go. So all in all, YouTube hasn't really done a great deal. It was always hard for a small channel to get going. They've raised the barrier, in my view, because of things like Patreon and the big channels, the 100k plus channels, um, moaning about loss of revenue. So they've that, to my mind, they've taken it away from the small channels. Uh, it wasn't much anyway. Um, it probably allowed them to say to the, the, the bigger channels, look, see, it's not just you, we bash. Um, however, this channel will stay. I'm not going anywhere. This, for me, it's not about the money. It's about sharing Scotland and a record of what we get up to in our motorhome, Desmond. So, to make it all not doom and gloom, here's a little bit of an unpublished video to relax before we say goodbye. Please enjoy, calm down, YouTube is for fun.
Next week's video will be the Packhorse Bridge, Glenlivet. We were there 12th to the 14th of January and it should have obviously shown last week uh, as part of my trying to get closer to when we actually uh, do the trips. But I had to have this little say about YouTube.